because alhamdulillah for those of you who are still wondering and and um, <clears throat> i don't really like to respond to negative statements and i don't believe in responding to negative statements but from an educational point of view i like to remind myself and remind you of things that may be very important islamically i know some people have been asking on the question of six feet apart i think they understand the the mask i don't have the mask because everyone are almost 20 feet apart from me here <clears throat> um, i do have the mask in my pocket and i must make that very clear but because i'm doing the khutbah it's sort of uncomfortable here right now and even the CDC head guys, they don't have the mask when they're on the news conference. So they will have to, we'll have to discuss that with them. Dr. Fauci, or Fauci, or whatever you call him. He doesn't have the mask when he speaks. Ah, neither President Trump. So let's, we, we talk about that after. Anyhow, we Islamically, from an Islamic jurisprudence point of view, yes, it's permissible under these conditions, of coronavirus and the situations in mosques and uh, the, the the limit of the people to pray six feet apart the salah is valid there are people who have been asking is the prayer valid we are supposed to pray side by side well listen side by side it's the requirement for praying congregational prayer so this is a congregational prayer, Juma, the five times prayer. But if a person is not in the line and a person stands alone in the back line, let's say the second line, there's nobody in the line. The law is he's supposed to take someone from the front line to join him in the second line, right? So he's not alone. But if he does not take someone to join him, is his salah valid or not? Yes, his salah is valid. And he's not six feet apart. He may be a hundred feet apart from anyone. He's all alone. The point I'm getting at, my brothers and sisters, from a jurisprudence point of view, yes, it's the sunnah, it's the sharia, that when you pray congregational prayer, when you pray congregational prayer, that you pray together, side by side. But on conditions that we are going through right now, on conditions that we are going through right now the six feet apart is totally permissible and the fukaha have all agreed the majority actually the majority of school of thought have agreed on that plus we the salah is valid and i'm saying this because a lot of people a lot of people close down their mosque because they do not believe the, no, could you leave, leave it please? they do not believe they do not believe in um, praying six feet apart so they are of the opinion that if you cannot pray close together then shut down if you have to pray separate but your salah is valid and that's why we have kept this open because it's the law in the state of Florida that religious services are considered essential and i like to repeat this because of questions that people ask saying that the prayer is not valid when you pray six feet apart many of the fukaha and a lot of the, the scholars worldwide have accepted it's valid there are a few who don't well we don't follow those few <clears throat>